We will learn about AMGM inequality in this particular video in a geometric way. This is a concept video series on Maths Olympiad and ISI entrance. The video is sponsored by Chinta.com. Hello everyone, my name is Oshuni Dajgupto. I am one of the faculty members at Chinta. Let's dive right to, into it. We'll start with a circle and we will draw the diameter of the circle. Let's mark the center of the circle and call that point O. Also the two endpoints of the circle of, of the diameter are X and Y. Now <coughs> pick any point M on the diameter. M can be any point. It could be the center but just for fun let's not take the center. Let's suppose M is any other point. Uh, erect a perpendicular from M uh, such that it hits the circle one more time at the point N. So we have this perpendicular segment MN. right? Uh, this point M divides XY into two parts. One is XM. Suppose the length of XM is small a. And we have the other part which is YM. Uh, suppose the length of YM is small b. Okay, so M is dividing the diameter into two parts XM and YM which are of length small a and small b. Finally, uh, draw the radius starting at O perpendicular to the diameter. Suppose it's OT. Okay, so we have the diagram ready. Now the question is, what is the length of the segment MN in terms of small a and small b? Like can you pause the video here and give it a try? Can you find geometrically the length of MN in terms of small a and small b? Put a comment in the description. Tell me how you did it. Okay, so I'll give the final answer. It is square root of a times b. In fact, this is the geometric construction of square root of a number. All right, now let's talk about the radius. What is the length of the radius? Well, we come back to the picture one more time. The diameter is small a plus small b. That's the length of xy. So the radius must be a plus b over 2, right? Okay, so we are almost done. We notice that Mn is less than the radius. Of course, any other half chord will be less than the radius because any chord is less than the diameter. If you look at the picture, it's absolutely clear that Mn is a half chord which is not the radius because M was not the center. We did not pick M to be the center. So the radius is definitely larger than Mn which gives us the inequality that square root of a times b is less than or equal to a plus b over 2. Okay, so we have this um, beautiful expression for geometric mean and arithmetic mean. Geometric mean being square root of a times b and arithmetic mean being a plus b over 2. And we have this much desired inequality that square root of a plus b, a times b is less than or equal to a plus b over 2. This is the arithmetic mean geometric mean inequality. One exciting thing about Chinta is that we have both one to one classes and group classes for every student. So it greatly personalizes the program for advanced mathematics. Chinta faculty team comprises of Olympians, researchers and students of ISI and CMI. You can go to chinta.com to learn more about them. Thank you for watching this video. Keep Stay subscribed to Chinta and I will see you in the next one.